this color, an orange-like hue, the snow varying from light yellow to deep orange, had many worrying it was either radioactive or full of chemicals. But a local forecaster there told local media that the orange color was actually caused by a coating of sand blown in by a cyclone from the Western Sahara, which brought sand all the way from the African desert to Russia and Jen, you've actually covered this phenomenon. Yeah, you know, actually I've seen that before. I did international weather for many years and you can see the image behind me and you can see the color of the orange shaded there, right there up to the bottom of the screen. Well, this happens actually quite often for areas including Mongolia, Inner Mongolia, and you're thinking to yourself, why? Well, we have the Gobi Desert and it pulls up that sand and that's when you see that orange dusting out there. I like my snow to be white and crisp. <laughs> Yeah, no, don't right. we all? Yeah. Uh, you know, you know what's interesting though. If you think about what happens in the summertime, all right, you get the big Bermuda high that's set up, and that circulation comes over the Sahara and blows that dust off Africa. We've showed you tons of satellite pictures of this. If you live in the Caribbean and are watching this this morning, you know exactly what I'm talking about. That dust accumulates on your vehicles, even in Florida. And yeah. Sam, you know this in Miami, it accumulates yeah. your vehicle. So now. Let's take the winter version of that. Mm -hmm. It can happen in the other direction. Absolutely, so let's bring Niz into this discussion as well because we also see it in volcanoes where that ash will get into the jet stream and we know it can travel thousands oh, yeah. of miles. Absolutely, and, and you know, as Jen said, this is not all that uncommon in Russia because at this time of the year, Jim mentioned that, that jet stream works its way further south. Now this actually came out of, remember Winter Storm Juno we talked about that yeah, came off the coast? Yeah, yeah, That system worked its way across the ocean. We've got a globe graphic to show Amazing. this here. And as it did, it actually caused a dip in the jet stream into Europe and across Northern Africa. Now what we're doing here is we're actually taking a trajectory of the air mass all the way back to Get where it began. Out of here. Yeah, back off the coast here of North America, and that trajectory goes all the way back to Winter Storm Juno. So there it is right there. There is Juno several days ago, and as that worked its way across the Atlantic and into Europe, yeah. it actually caused the jet stream to dip into North Africa. To drop right North across Africa. the desert into and, North Africa. And then you had a westerly flow of air to a west to southwest flow that actually brought that dust up across Siberia or uh, across Russia, Georgia, those provinces in Russia will often see this at this time of the year.